when you look at aviators as a non-aviator, um, especially generally speaking in the past, up until you know it starts to improve recently, you know, without that lack of, of diversity, you know, if you're not from somewhere where people look like you or are from where you're from, you just look, well, that's just not for me or for people who are from where I'm from. But when you see that it's for, it's for everybody, it really like, okay, I can do this. Uh, and a lot of people don't understand the impact of seeing something to believe in it. The Aim High Flight Academy uh, was designed uh, as part of the Rated Diversity Initiative to increase diversity amongst the rated career fields in the Air Force. So the program is designed to remove barriers, uh, prepare students or potential uh, applicants to become rated officers. So they're gonna learn about how to fly an airplane, um, learn weather, learn aerodynamics, all those things that come along with knowing how to fly. They'll go in the simulator so they can learn the different procedures associated with uh, flying airplanes and get to practice them while still on the ground. And then the best part is the actual experiential part of it, which is actually getting to fly a plane. But it's not just they're going to fly a plane for fun one time. They're going to spend three weeks to get from, I've only flown a plane maybe once or twice before getting here, all the way to soloing. And what soloing means, it's not just they can fly the plane by themselves with an instructor, it's they're gonna to get to the point where they're gonna get in the plane by themselves, take off, fly around, and be able to land safely uh, in the airplane. So you can just imagine like the level of confidence that that brings somebody, as well as how much closer it makes being a pilot in the Air Force for them. Because for a lot of them, they haven't, they don't know pilots, they haven't been around airports. They don't know this lifestyle that we live. And that also goes with having the different mentors here to kind of really show them, you know, really inspire them to want to do what it is that we do. And for them to also see the Air Force, the diversity in the Air Force, it helps them see, okay, well, everybody can do this. It's not just for people who got a lot of money or people who are, you know, in a certain uh, socioeconomic class, you know, it's for everybody. The Aim High Flight Academy, and our diversity program under Detachment 1 and Air Force Recruiting Service is all about, in general, is about attracting the best and brightest young men and women from, from all across America. I use an analogy like this, it's not perfect, but if we were a sports team, we would want, if we held tryouts on a Saturday morning, we would want the best athletes from all over town to come out, to be able to envision themselves wearing our jersey, to come out and, and, and punt, pass, kick the ball with us, to uh, to run the 40, and we want to attract the, we want to throw the net as wide as we can. Now, that's the attraction piece, the inspire, to get them to think about wearing the jersey of the United States Air Force. When it comes to the selection piece, we're gonna take the best and brightest. We can't do anything less. Anything else is a failing proposition for national security. We've got to maintain the highest quality. We've got to be the best, most credible, most capable, most lethal Air Force on the planet, hands down, not non-negotiable. If we cast a wide net, we're able to attract all of America, we will get the best and we will be the most capable.